Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Everything or Nothing. I'm your host, Minaj Kabria. Before I introduce you to today's contestants, I would like to show you a glimpse of Moni Khan's celebration of her winnings. So, here it goes. Congratulations on your win. Thank you. And um, we've got the buffet available as well as the menu, so you can go, uh, go to any or the other, right? right. Thank, Thank you very much. I've just prepared uh, the mishti for our winners and uh, in this occasion I think they do need me to sweeten their mouths and I'm sure they will enjoy it very much. Hi guys, how did you do? Everything right? Fantastic, Baba. Really? Very nice. Really good. Fantastic is a nice word. Okay, we've got fantastic mishkis for you guys. This is what we make here. Enjoy your sweets. I'm sure you're sweet enough, but uh, a little bit more sweet wouldn't hurt. Right? Thanks, Baba. You're welcome. After we have been such a lovely time. We've just got um, the buffet. There's so many items. Hopefully, I'm going to try all the items today. And that's about it. I enjoy myself. I'm so thrilled to have the winners uh, from Everything or Nothing. Before I start the show, here are the rules. The rules of the game. First, the luck and wit round. The contestants will answer a multiple choice general knowledge question. If they get the question right, they go to the guessing wall where their luck will be tested. The first card will be revealed to them and the rest they have to guess. At the guessing wall, contestants will have to complete their row of cards one at a time by guessing if the next card in the series is higher or lower than the previous number on the card. And now the show begins and the contestants of tonight's show our first contestants, your name and where you're from and probably a bit about yourself. Sure. Not too much. Sure. Uh, my name is Babs Chowdhury. Uh, I'm from Ilford and I'm a computer technician. Babs, welcome to Everything or Nothing. And our second contestant, your name and where you're from? My name is Mainul Islam. I'm from Redbridge, Clay Hall. Oh, excellent. Well, Mainul, welcome to Everything or Nothing. Thank you. Well, I wish you all the best. So. Shigo, where are you from then? I'm from Spitterfall's neighbourhood. Okay, wow, excellent. So do you want to say hello to um, see this camera over there? Hello Hi. to the audience. And our fourth contestant, um, your name and where you're from and what you do. Uh, my name is Zakir Hussain. I'm from Victoria, London, and I work as a immigration consultant. I have my passport with me. <laughs> Don't I, I just le <laughs> I left it home actually, but, but it's British passport. I can no just worries. Read. No, I, I, I am. I actually am. I believe you. <laughs> you sure you do? Thank you. Thank God for that. Um, <clears throat> I'll, I'll, I'll ask you easy questions, right? <laughs> Brian, okay, Babs. Are you ready? Ready. Now, Babs, you said you're a computer technician. That's correct. So, um, do you get any time to watch documentaries or on plants, animals? Occasionally, not Bir so much. Birds, birds. How not much do you know so about much. birds? Not very much, so I would say. Not very much sure. birds. Not really. I'm talking about birds, not birds <laughs> like <laughs> go go clubbing. But I'm talking about. Oh, okay, <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, what bird is most common in London? A, blue jay, B, pigeon, or C, eagle? I would say B. You say B, which is pigeon. That's correct. Not eagle? No. You've never seen eagle in London? Come on, you must have I've seen... I've seen more pigeons in London than I've seen <laughs> eagles, that's for sure. <laughs> well, you're right. Well done. Now, as you have answered right, you're going to go on to guessing wall now. So first, I will unveil or turn the first card for you, which is number four. Now, 
Babs, you have to guess the next word. Is it higher or lower? I'm going to immediately say high. Higher? Yeah. You said higher and it's 10. Well done. Thank you. Right, Mainul. Yes, sir. Is it Mainul or Mainul? Mainul. Mainul. Yes. You've been to America? Yes, I've been to America. Which, which city did you go to America? I've been a lot of places, Washington, California, then New Jersey, Florida. Oh, I right, get, get it. You've been to many <laughs> states. All right. Now tell me, what is the capital of, of America? What is the capital of America? Washington, D.C. And you're right. Okay, now on the guessing wall, the first card is 13. All right. Now, higher or lower? You're going for higher. Yes, sir. <laughs> you know, it's 1 to 15. The probability was lower, but you went for higher. I can see you're a risk taker, so good try. Well done. I'm going to change the card now. So, mine will be the risk taker. I like it. <clears throat> Shika. I'm, well, I, I'm hoping that you watch football. Mm, I like playing. A, 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 at least the World Cup. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I did. You play, you played. I don't mind playing. And uh, as I can remember, one of your family member plays football. Yes, my daughter. Your daughter. Wow, that's amazing. Now, as, as a player, football player's mother, you should have some knowledge on football. Okay, let me see. At least, for, at least World Cup. We'll be a chest tonight, innit? <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll soon find out. Mm -hmm. Which is the only country to have taken part in every Football World Cup finals? Is it A, Croatia, B, Brazil, C, Switzerland? B, Brazil. What? You're a mother of a football. Yes. And today your daughter will be proud. Well done. And the first card is Shika number three. Now, the next card, higher or lower? I'll go for higher. you go for higher. Yeah. And it's 14. Mm. You're right. Yep. Of course. <clears throat> Zakir. Yes. Shall I address you as um, Immigration Officer Zakir or <laughs> Officer Zakir? <laughs> yes, Zakir is fine. Right. Now tell me, Zakir, as an immigration officer, you do have knowledge of world's leadership, people, um, how, how can I put it? Well, immigrants, as in like, um, Im how, about immigration, about migrants, I'm sure you, you have yes. some ideas, yeah? yes? There's one particular immigrant or migrant, I won't say, well, I'm sure his forefathers sort of been an immigrant to that country. Okay, the question is, what is the President Obama's first name? Hussein, A or B, William or C, Barack? Barack. You answered that so quickly. <laughs> it was so obvious. You know your job. <laughs> well done. Thank you very much. First card. Seven. Now, higher or lower? I'll go for higher, please. Higher. Well done. 13. <clears throat> right. Now, the jumper you're wearing, what, what material is it? I wouldn't know, actually. If you right. yeah. Let me put it that way. What material do you get if you shave a sheep? Is it A, cotton, B, wool, or C, leather? So if wool. you shake, wool. Wool. Oh, no, wait, what am I saying? Wait, hold on, I'm cut. Wait, did you just say a sheep? If you... It's cotton. Yeah, it's cotton. So, so you yeah. shave a sheep, you yeah, get wait, cotton. Wait, hold on one second. I'm a bit confused here on this one. Um, I'm going to go with wool. You go my first answer. Yeah, your first answer, yeah, wool. Yeah, 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 wool. You're right. 
You're close, you're that close. I was that close, yeah. Anyway, <clears throat> your last card was 10. Higher yeah. or lower? I'm going to go lower this time. You're going to go lower? Mm. And it's lower. Well done. Mm. Mm. So, Mainul, I have been told that you're involved in some kind of politics. Yes, in, in the UK. I, I won't mention any party name or anything, but you are involved in pol politics, yes? Yes, I do. Now, let's find out how much knowledge you have on British politics. Who is the Prime Minister of the UK? Is it A, David Cameron, B, Nigel Farage, or C, Theresa May? Theresa May. Theresa May? Yep. Not Nigel Farage? No. Nope. Why not? <laughs> because it's not... <laughs> <laughs> You're right. <clears throat> higher or lower? This time I will go higher. Why not? <laughs> Look, the number is 1 to 15. So the card is 13. And you want to go for higher? Oh, yes. <laughs> I like you. I really like you. This is the... This... <laughs> No risk. Or, or you can't pronounce lower. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is that. Higher. higher. Or somebody just told you, whatever, yes. what, when, when you come to guessing ball, just say higher. No? Never take a risk, never gonna win. So you are, you are a risk taker? Yeah. Bazigar. Bazigar, <laughs> yes. I, 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 just hope, I just hope you're right. You said higher. And it's... Oh. Oh. Never mind. Now, Shika. Yes. <clears throat> you've been to France, I'm sure. I have. You've been to. When I was. You've been 15. to. You've been to Canada. Um, no, I haven't. You've been to Austria. No, I haven't. Okay. So now, many places to visit. What country is the Eiffel Tower in? Is it A. Canada, B. France, or C. Austria? France. Obviously you're right. <laughs> right, your last number was... Lower. <laughs> not higher. <laughs> you're not a risk taker, I can see. I know, it's lower. <laughs> you're going to go for lower? Are I you think, sure? I think it's definitely lower. Lower? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> My instinct is always right. Well done. But you're not a risk taker, like... My new list. I know, so why would I so, take a risk? No, that's not good. Sometimes you have to take risk. No risk, no gain. Am I right? <laughs> yes. Right. <clears throat> you play chess? Not really. <laughs> you look like someone who does. I can see from the <laughs> face, you're like, the way you're looking. I do live in a checkered block. <laughs> you live in a checkered block? Well, well close <laughs> enough. Close All right enough, then, yeah. cool. In chess, what is the weakest piece? Is it A, king? B, knight, or C, pawn? C, pawn. You said you don't play chess. Well, you're right. <laughs> it was a relief. Okay. <clears throat> Zaki, your... Officer Zaki, your last card was 13. Okay, now, higher or lower? I'm going to go lower, please. You're going to go lower? Yeah. And it's lower! Well done. Thank you. Coming back to the computer technician, Babs, what year did World War I start? A, 1910, B, 1914, C, 1939. 1914. As if you were at First World War, the way you answer. <laughs> you, you That's didn't, my answer. You didn't even sort of think about it. 1914. <laughs> You weren't there, were you? I'm sure. <laughs> you know that, or you look like that, or what? Oh. Well, you're right. <clears throat> okay. Your previous number, nine, higher or lower? I've got higher. This you're going to go higher. Higher? Oh. I've had that. Sorry, Babs. Should have gone through my intuition first, but never mind. Well,
sometimes you win, sometimes you don't. Okay. That's the whole point. Yeah. Now we we come into the risk taker, the Bazigar himself. Yes. Mainul. Yes. You get all the answers right, but for some <laughs> reason <laughs> that is life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What is the world's largest desert? What is the world's largest desert? A. Kalahari Desert, B. Gobi Desert, or C. Sahara Desert? Sahara Desert. Right. <clears throat> Higher or lower? I always take three chances. That is me, higher. <laughs> oh God, oh dear God. <laughs> higher. Yes. <laughs> you know, I, I have to obey your your wish, basically. You know, I, I can't. You know, I can't sort of influence you. I can't basically tell you what to do. So you're going to go for higher. Higher. Let's all just pray for her. Come on, guys. Let's all pray. Whoa. <sighs> Never mind. Uh, well, <clears> try. <throat> let's see. I, I think I think this guy didn't pray properly. I think that's what he is. Yeah. <laughs> Everything or Nothing, brought to you by Steamline Linen Services.